Yeah, so um, here's the picture calibration for this, for HDR on this game. Well, any PlayStation, to be honest, any PlayStation game that's HDR. It does work for um SDR too, but I think it really shows its, its true colors on HDR. But anyway, this is what I did. For um the picture mode, I chose collaborated. I mean, sorry, I'm sorry. Calibrated. I chose calibrated, and um, I saved it as um PS4 Pro calibration. But you can name it whatever you want to name it, or whatever. But um, always choose calibration. I think um, calibration dark is kind of too dark, and calibration is a little bit white. It's a little bit um lighter. Not not too light, but it's it's, it's basically it's better. And the color, the color is more intact, if I'm saying that right. It's more native, native looking color. When it's when it's calibrated dark, the, the colors seem a little, like a little bit dim compared to calibrated. But anyway, yeah, that's what I chose. I named it PS4 Pro Calibrated. Auto brightness off, always. Backlight, 100%. Backlight should always be 100% when it comes to HDR content. No matter what room, what kind of your lighting is in the room or whatever, it should always, backlight should always be 100% on HDR content. Brightness. I usually have it at 45, but it seems that 50 seems to be seems to be um well I can I say 50 and 45 is like it's kind of like the same thing but 45 the 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 it's the image is more darker but I keep it at 50 I don't know if you guys can see it in the background how dark and how light it light it gets but I think um 50 is perfect it's not too dark not too light is when you go over 51 when you go over over 51 that's when everything gets too dark too bright as you can see 51 makes a big difference so keep it at 50 don't go higher than 50 contrast now this is the thing with this TV the Vizio M70 D3 it's an HDR TV it's not a full on wide color gamut HDR TV it's a high contrast HDR TV, meaning this TV shines its best at, shines its best at high contrast video playing. So when it comes to contrast, you don't want to it the 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 normal contrast is at fifty, but to me I think fifty is a little bit too bright. It kind of washes out the colors. You can't really see a big difference like that, but you want to lower it to about 47. 45 is too dark. Leave it at 47, which is in the middle. If this was a daytime, daytime scene right now, you'll see the sun. You could tell your contrast is too high. If the sun, if you look up to the sun while you're playing the game, you can't see an outline of the sun. To me, that's like the only way you can tell if your contrast is too high. When you're playing the game, look at the sun. If you look in the sky and see a bright blur, contrast is way too high. You have to look at the sun to see an outline of the sun. That's how you know your contrast is at the right spot. If you, if you make your contrast that you can see an outline of the sun, keep the contrast right there. Not one over, not one under, but keep it right there. But for our TVs, 47 is the right contrast when playing HDR. Color, color is a preference. I seem to like, I like more color on my video games because it's a video game. It's not real life. Sorry about that. Shout out to Mr. 4K Upscaler. He just popped up. He just let me know that he podcasting something. Not podcasting, video casting something, but doing this right now. But, um... Where was I? Color. Color's a preference. 
don't go under 50 don't go over 60 you will start it will start bleeding the colors if you're over 60 when playing video games in HDR sharpness is also a preference but over 25 it starts over sharpening so keep it under 25 you could go from 0 to 25 20 seems to be the ideal ideal um settings for um sharpness but a lot of games are different but for this game Horizon Zero Dawn 23 seems to be perfect tint I always lower the tint because to me tint makes the faces look a little bit if you keep it at zero the faces have a green tint to it and I don't like the green tint so I, I either two either two or three the lower you get in the tint the redder the face gets so keep it at like two or three my temperature is always cool I always like cool cause cool reminds me of white and I like my pictures to be white so you could pick normal well I wouldn't pick normal normal is too yellow computer is good too but I think cool it's either cool or computer but I think cool is the best black detail I keep it at low low gives the the background it gives the background it's the background stays the same but little light light areas it brightens up the light areas but for high if you go high it lightens up the whole image let me see if you can see it in the background hey, you can clearly see it in the background when I click high the back image gets light if I click low certain parts get dark see the dark images they get darker put it on low perfect medium you can't really tell from medium and low but how you tell the big difference now off everything gets dark low well you can't see it on the camera but the whites get a little bit whiter so I keep it on white. Active LEDs, keep that always on because that's why you bought this TV for the local dimming. So always keep that on. This is these two are preference. Reduce judder, motion blur. That's those are preference. I like the soap opera effect. I don't know. It's something about it. It reminds me of high quality movies or whatever. I don't know. I just like the soap opera effect. Clear action. I don't think you could pick this on collaborate. No, you can't pick it on calibrated. Signal noise off, black noise off, because those just degrade the picture. You don't need those. Those are for like watching cable or whatever. Game latency. If you want it on, it just, it doesn't really degrade the picture. It just takes away these two things. As you can see, that you can't select them anymore, which is a soap opera effect. It takes those away. Turn it back off. They be, they're able to pick again. I like them on so I keep the game latency off. Film mode. This is for 24p um 